And as of this recording, I got them today. And an idea that I've had before I got them, actually I also mentioned them here. If you see me doing this, or maybe this, I'm getting my cheek out of a hook. It's a small hook. So, this act is, well I don't need to tell you what it's called, you can see the title! Wait a minute. Welcome to Pachyballahan! And another act! What does ACT stand for? Well, ACT stands for Acapella Tune, and this ACT is called Brace. Let. Okay, right now I am finished with the ACT. I will show you the ACT in a moment, but at the beginning I created, or I mean I had three comments and I already made the, the recording for the three comments. Let's listen to those comments. So far, I only have one note for my voice. And... Uh, I have three comments. First of all, that note, you hear how good it is, it's because this sine wave, the sine wave instrument is good for tuning. So my next note will be E, so... Uh, there we go. Second comment. Well, you can see that foundation looks different since my previous act. And uh, my third comment is... I have rubber bands. Okay. Uh, you just listened to the comments, and I had just cut this recording. This is the, the recording just before the same recording just before the comments, and and I cut it and put the comments recording in the cut. So I'll go ahead and put this check mark. The shaker soloed. Okay. Uh, let me resize the window as well. The recording window. Okay, that's better, don't you think? Enough stalling. Let's listen to Brace Let. Still have to soloed. For real this time, legitimately, let's listen to Brace Let. Absolutely no more interruptions.
Okay, if you're a smart, click the like button. Wait. How did I end my brace axe? I forget how I end my brace axe. Stay tuned for... Ah, uh, of course. I say my no more outro and... Hint at the next one, okay? If you are smart, click the like button. If you're a genius, click the subscribe button. Oh, okay, this recording is much later and I already removed my rubber band, so it's easier for me to talk than earlier. You will see me next time. Stay tuned for Brace of Shakes. It'll be nautical sounding. It'll be short. Okay, so actually, here's here's history. And I might forget to explain this next time. But then I don't have to since I'm doing it this time. I was doing research for new, or not new, but that, well, new to me, phrases that start with the word brace. And I found a brace of shakes. What does that mean? Well, it means, like, in an instant, or in a short time. And, oh, this could be a short petite act. And when I searched the the origins of it, it has nautical origins. Ah, that'd be perfect. I'll create an act, of course, while I still have my braces, and, you know, it'll, it'll be nautical sounding, like, I am a pirate. I don't think there could be any lyrics, but you get what I mean. Like a sailor or a pirate song, and it'll be short. Like, uh, you know, influenced by the meaning and the, the definition, or the, the origin and the, the meaning. Okay.
here I can search by title or instrument. I want a song with horns in it. Could be English horns or French horns or horns in general. So let's start with the first one. I'll read the instruments, which of course includes horns. Instruments. Piano, percussion, xylophone, berry sax, tuba, trumpet. So I didn't mention the horns yet. Let's find out what kind of horns it has. Car horns? You never know how effective a car horn is until you use it. Usually, park my car in your sidewalk and alarm seven. Okay. Wait a minute. This song has a Picardy, Picardy, not sure if it's Picardy, third, with car horns. <laughs> this is royalty free. I am not going to get sued. Especially I'm showing the credits here. Attrib the credits attribution here. Creative Commons. So I am definitely not going to get in trouble for playing this. At the, look at the very end is the accord with Carl Horns, made out of Carl Horns. Kevin has used English horns, French horns. Clown horns and now car horns. What's next? 